Hi, good morning. Um, here in this, in this work that I'm going to present, we are studying, as most of you, a mixed forest stands. In this case, we studied uh, Scott Pine and Faust Silvatica, well, and beach, European beach, in, in two sites uh, across Europe. In uh, some plots located near München, and near in the Bavarian zone with the Hans group, and uh, another one uh, in Poland, close to, to Varsovia. Ui, perdón. Sorry, to Cracovia. <laughs> yeah, to Krakow. Uh, in this case, uh, we were studying the soils of these forests to, in order to see if the, the different percentage of mixture of the, this, these two species uh, has any effect on the soil. We studied the organic horizons and the mineral horizons uh, in different um, triplets with two scales, because normally we work, or foresters work, with the plots, with the big plots, but when we talk about the soils, we need to get into smaller paths, because the differences in just a few meters could be very big. So inside these triplets, we established different subplots, circular subplots, five meters radius, and we studied there these organic and mineral horizons. Uh, here you can't see anything, but if you go to, my, to the poster, um, in, this, in these graphs, uh, the most important one for me is the, the letter C, because there you can see the carbon to nitrogen radio in the little form, in which we found our best uh, results. We could see, well, first of all, which scale is better to use, because we compared the plot scale and the subplot scale, and as we, as we thought, the subplot scale or micro scale was better because it was consist consistent with the plot, the plot level uh, results, but also it allowed us to see more in deep and to find uh, quadratic evolutions in the, in the different uh, variables and also to differentiate between the mixed and the beach plots. Okay, and so just to, to say, um, we decided for the subplot level uh, scale, and the big differences were found in the litter fall. The, the mineral soil was barely affected, only the total organic carbon was the, the variable that changed. And uh, our main thing was that in the carbon to nitrogen radio, which talks us about the quality of this organic matter, uh, we found that in the mixtures with 25 to 50 percent of pine, we found the better values of this carbon to nitrogen radio, indicating a better quality of this organic matter. 